Bila shaka ubuheri wa afya na kama hali yako ni dhoho fulhari basi Mungu wa kuafu ili urejelee katika afya yako na uendeleze majukumu ya kulijenga taifa kama vile ambavyo ulikuwa ukifanya ukiwa na afya tele sasa ikiwa maandamano yamehitimishwa jijini Dar es Salaam tuelekee kule Indonesia kwa mama Kizimkazi nambari moja kabisa ambaye yeye amekwisha fika pale nchini Indonesia lakini pia rais huyu wa Jamhuri ya Muungano wa Tanzania Mheshimiwa Samia Suluhu Hasani amewasilisha ujumbe wa Tanzania kwenye mazungumzo eh, na rais ama mwenyeji wake rais wa Jamhuri ya Indonesia Mheshimiwa Jomo Widodo pamoja na ujumbe wake katika ofisi ya rais huyo eh, Bogor Presidential Palace tarehe 25 Januari 2024 nazungumzia siku ya hii leo ambapo pamoja na mambo mengine mheshimiwa rais Dr. Samia Suluh Hassan amezungumza na waandishi wa habari kuelekea masuala mbalimbali ya ziara yake nchini humo. Hebu tuitizame na kuisikiliza hotuba ya rais Dr. Samia Suluh Hassan kule oh, nchini thank Indonesia. You, Your Excellency uh, Mr. President we do do for the cordial reception and warm hospitality extended to me and my delegation since our arrival in this green city of Jakarta. The relations between Tanzania and Indonesia have a rich history. Our founding fathers, the late Mwalimu Jinerere and President Sukarno, laid a strong foundation for these relations. Subsequent generations of leaders have continued to cement our bilateral relations building on this foundation. Recent high-level visits of Jakarta and Dar es Salaam attest not only to our friendship but also commitment to enhance and advance our bilateral ties to greater heights. As such, on this visit, I'm delighted that President Widodo and I are standing on the great shoulders of our predecessors in nurturing this unique and historic relations. President Widodo summed up almost everything that transpired during our official talks. On my part, I'll touch on a few issues. Apart from being my first visit overseas in 2024, this visit is opportune, timely, and much more significant. This is because This year we are marking 60 years since the establishment of our diplomatic relations. To us, Indonesia has been a friend of all season and all weather because our relation date back to pre-colonial days and once officiated, it was among the first countries to open its embassy in Tanzania. Our discussion was cordial mutual and friendly we took stock of the implementation status of agreements reached during president widodo's visit to tanzania in august 2023 and our emphasis was to ensure effective implementation we expressed our satisfaction on our bilateral ties and agreed to advance and consolidate the excellent relations that so happily exists between our two countries. We also insisted on the need to continue to use multilateral fora to solve global challenges. On trade and investment, both President Widodo and myself attach great importance to promoting bilateral investment between our two countries. And this is why uh, later on today I I will participate in the Indonesian Tanzania Business and Investment Forum. The forum will bring together our two business community, government officials and other stakeholders from our two countries. On our part, we'll highlight the trade and investment potentials and opportunities available in Tanzania. My mantra to the private sector or uh, to the private sector partners is The best time to invest in Tanzania was two years ago, but the second best time is now. On cooperation in energy, 
We took note on the recent developments, including the concluded agreement between Tanzania Petroleum and Development Corporation and Petamina. I thank President Widodo for his leadership on this matter, and I believe that this agreement will open more doors to Indonesian investors in the energy sector in Tanzania. We further expressed our readiness to harness Indonesian experience through collaboration and investment in the renewable energy to leapfrog development in this sector, which has abandoned, abundant and lucrative potential. This morning, President Widode and I also did some tree planting as reaffirmation of our shared commitment to building a safer planet. In global conservation on protecting our environment, Tanzania continues to underscore the access to clean and safer cooking fuels and technologies. Access to clean cooking fuel not only empowers our community, but also protects our trees. As such, aware of the strides Indonesia has made to promote clean cooking practices, we agreed to work more closely and share experiences with Indonesia in support of clean cooking solutions in Africa. Talking on blue economy, our discussions also looked at cooperation in the blue economy sector, and this is an unexploited or unexploited sector in Tanzania. And I informed my colleague on the deliberate policies and measures that my country have put, has put in place aimed at harnessing the full potential of this sector. Given its wealth of experience and advancement in this arena, we, can, we have concluded an OMOU with Indonesia to deepen our cooperation in this sector as we all witnessed. As I conclude, Mr. President, I wish to thank you for, the, for your invitation to me to visit your beautiful country. I also wish to say Terry Makassie for the opportunity to advance our rich ties for the benefit of our people. I hope after your retirement you will be able to visit Tanzania as a tourist to experience our scenic tourist sites. I'll be happy to host you in my tiny village in the Spice Islands of Zanzibar. Kama ulivo msikia, akitimisha hapo e, mazungumzo yake ama hotuba yake ama e, kile ambacho ametaka kuwasilisha e, na kumshauri ama kumwalika e, rais wa Indonesia e, Jomo Widodo e, atembele baada ya kustafu kwake ama katika kipindi chake chochote cha mapumziko e, katika ardhi ya Tanzania haswa e, katika visiwa vya Zanzibari ili afanye utalii na mheshimiwa rais Dr. Samia Suluhu Hassani amemwambia ama amemhakikishia pia akija nchini Tanzania hasa pale Zanzibar yeye atakuwa kama tour guide wake ama atakuwa msindikizaji na kumuonyesha kumuelekeza tamaduni za Watanzania na waswahili wa kweli kweli wanaopatikana pale Zanzibar bari ama hapa eh, mchini Tanzania. Asante wa bado wa katabahu fakir lakini kabla sija kuaga siku ya hii leo ni kusisitize ku like eh, kusubscribe na kucomment YouTube channel yetu hii hapa ili wa kwanza kupata kila habari pale ambapo tutakuwa tunakuwekea eh, mtandaoni. Eh, yuka huku nikiweweseka kiwenda wazimu.